spent their entire existence telling people that even the smallest piece of gun reform is going to lead to confiscation for two reasons. One, they want to keep the market open to help the gun industry sell more guns. And two, they want to increase their revenues and their dues and continue to buy Wayne LaPierre really expensive suits, I guess. Okay. So they're not concerned about keeping us safe. That much is clear. Wayne LaPierre and his suits don't matter to big business. We know that government is powerful, yes. but business is as well. Let's Tom Brokaw said it yeah. earlier. Walmart is America. Yes. Walmart is the largest employer in the United States, one of the largest sellers of assault-style weapons. Could we see big business take action? After the shooting in Parkland, we saw Dick Sporting Goods say, we are not going to sell these type of weapons anymore. We know it hurt their bottom line, but they stood by it. Listen, Walmart has such an important role to play here, and I think they can do three different things. One, I think they can announce we're going to stop selling guns until we raise the standard of gun ownership in America. Well, they have raised the, the age. To, to the age, yes. to 21. Two, uh, they are, uh, two, they can say we're going to stop giving dollars to lawmakers who are backed by the NRA. That's going to be massive. And three, we're going to start investing in the communities that we serve. And we're going to start funding gun buybacks to get some of those guns off the street. Walmart is such a major player. They're so large that if they really decided to lean into this issue, we could see some real change. We should all call on Walmart to do that. Lean into safety. I think that's Lean what you're calling safety, for. Lean into safety, indeed. Igor, thank you so much for thank joining you. me and sharing your insights. Coming up.